This is where I watched my parents die, Raphael. Hey, yo, check out this cool frog! He's gesturing at himself. I, I, I remembered Raphael was a turtle. Teenage Mutant Ninja Frogs, frog power! Frogs. Frogs. Count it off! One, two, three, four! Frogs. I don't know what's funnier. Pets with stereotypical human names like Brian and Michaela, or pets with completely ridiculous names like Hamburger and Concrete. Counterpoint. Both. One of each. These are my cats, Switchboard and Gary. Enough of this, this character is my son. This character is my nephew. Not my responsibility, but I am taking him out for lunch and buying him Hot Wheels. This is just when your friends have an OC that you really love. That's your nephew. Andy, put up a picture of Amy's Ethan. Behold, this is my nephew. <laughs> Which is also weird because I voice his dad, so also technically still my son. Shit, what have I done? Let me slip into something more comfortable. Downscales into 4080p. This is just me taking off my glasses. I'm reminded almost daily about how glad I am that Redditors remain out of positions of power and decision making. Far more upsetting though is the fact that the world seems to be run by Twitter users. Sometimes I think thank god Tumblr follower count is hidden. People over Twitter let the numbers go to their heads so much. Also, Tumblr numbers mean nothing considering the amount of bot followers. Even funnier when someone on Tumblr expects you to treat them as royalty for having a lot of followers like they are not also a Tumblr user. If you brag about your follower count here, it's like announcing your own clown shoe size. One time I dreamt my therapist was following me around at work, constantly interrupting me, trying to get me to talk to her. But how did that make you feel? Undertale of you where everything is the same except everyone swears like a sailor. Isn't that just Underfell? I'm pretty sure that's just Underfell. All right, I'm saying it. Barry B. Benson is a Jerry Seinfeld Mary Sue self-insert. Even as a kid, I got the feeling Barry got the human girl because the director was the main character. Fuck! Recent studies have shown that, in order to make room for learning spells, wizards will willingly give up the part of their brain where they learn from the consequences of their actions. <laughs> Magic make brain go brr. I think a lot about gaining weight as a form of healing. Character gets a little bit fat after a life of hardships. Me. Groundbreaking. Incredible. Life-changing. Kyle Gallen, I like your moxie. This is good for my brain, thank you. Ties a balloon to Snom. Look, you're flying! I have once again taken to the- Hang on, this is too high! Get me down! Get me down! Okay, I'm just gonna say it. <sighs> Uptown Funk would have made it into the Shrek soundtrack. That's... That's the truest statement I ever read. Just found out there are two bones in my shin and two shins on my body. That's four bones. Fuck this shit! Dude, that's not even the worst of it. Go look up what your ribs are made of. Okay, I will, but I'm warning you, if it's bones, I'm gonna be so pissed off. God damn it! A name is a spell you cast on your child when they're born. I cast Get Bullied in Middle School. Power word. Melvin. Today, Papa John's called my Starbucks and... <laughs> Starbucks? <laughs> Starbucks! Anyway, <clears throat> today Papa John's called my Starbucks and they were like, are you guys interested in a trade? And five Frappuccinos later, they gave us two large pizzas and a large order of cheesy bread. Okay, but this seems adorable to me. This is what my coffee shop does with the subway next door. One large latte equals one six inch sandwich. We trade at noon and 7 p.m. This is how the world should run. <laughs> oh, fucked up would it be if you jumped in a ball pit and it was just tomatoes painted different colors? Dashcon 2, I've got an idea for you. Seeing teens call 20-somethings old as a gotcha is so funny to me. Like, you are priming yourself for one hell of an existential crisis in five years. <laughs> I laugh at 30. Oh God, I'm fucking old as fuck now. Fuck! My blog aesthetic doesn't have a name. It's just me walking around picking up pebbles like, ooh, this one's pretty. Ooh, this one's pretty. Ooh, this one's pretty. There should be a heart key on the keyboard. You're absolutely right. Andy, put up the heart key button. Now spam it. Spam this ending full of hearts. Just do it, do it. Hit it like it's the muffin button. Just do it. Oh my God, look at all these hearts. It's taking over the video.
I would laugh if you just did nothing.